Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Gossip Runway. I'm Terika, you already know. Tasha. <laughs> I thought you got to introduce me. Sorry. <laughs> AKA Brown Face with no O. No O. <laughs> uh, today we're going to talk to y'all about a couple more things. First of all, I just want to say thank you for everybody who watched the first episode. If you haven't watched it yet, make sure you scroll down, watch it, leave a comment, <clears throat> let us know what you think about it. Make sure y'all comment on this episode. Also, we're going to break it up into two parts. Part one is going to be friends with benefits. With benefits. Yeah. And then part two is going to be the pros and cons of head, giving and receiving. <laughs> <laughs> the good and the bad. <laughs> so make sure y'all check out both parts. Let's split it up a little bit for those of y'all who said this first one was so. First, we're going to start off with friends with benefits. Does it work? Can it work? It might, maybe it can. What, what do you think, Tasha? Um, in a relationship, no. Because it, it's just not going to, I don't think it's going to work because we all seen the movies and all that. But it's really true, like you're going to start having feelings for that person because you're going to start like wanting to go on dates, you're going to be like sleeping in sometimes. Then it's like, okay, well, where, where are the rules, the guidelines? Right. What Are there guidelines to friends with benefits? Yeah. Where What are they? Cause no they never, sleeping over. No sleeping over. No. You hit it and you quit it for yes. the night. <laughs> right. You just call them and say, hey, I want some. Right. Where are you? Right. That's like your my after the club, right? Like after the it's club, like for type. sure. Or, sex. Yeah, yeah, for you sure. Know, it doesn't matter what, who you with, what you're doing. We could get it in, and then we out. No, right. Telling me how your day was. Yeah, don't call me unless we finna get it in. <laughs> don't text me. None of that stuff going on. Like with our friends, if we have mutual friends, if we're, when we're out and I see somebody and I'm like, oh, and I want to go talk or I want to go holla, you can't right. get mad. But they do. You can't get like, mad. I'm hitting that. Like, why are you talking to other people? You know, people get jealous because, you know, if you have sex with me, that's it. I don't care friends, benefits, my boyfriend, whatever. That's it. Ain't nobody else. Like, I'm just Yeah, I wish it was like that in a perfect world. <laughs> in, a perfect in my world, world if you're yeah. having sex with me, then you're only having sex with me. Yeah. And you still be friends mm -hmm. with that person after y'all done having sex. Say... Uh, okay, we didn't date it for a while and we're good. We've been having this whole first benefit situation. But then I meet somebody that I actually really like. Really? That, that gives me things that you don't give me because we don't have that emotional connection. We just right. have a sexual then connection. You can leave. Like, what's okay. Right, so I move on. Can I still be friends with the person that I. It depends on how emotionally unstable they are. Like, some people are just not fit for friends with benefits relationships or fuck buddies or whatever you want to call them, cuddy buddies. Like, People are just not fit for it. Some people are overly emotional. Like, they can't just have sex with someone, mostly females. They can't just have sex with someone and just, like, walk away. Like, dudes can nut and pull out and get up, put the clothes on, and walk out the door. And they on, on the way home, chilling, singing. Talking to somebody yeah. else already. Already. <laughs> they, you know, they don't have the emotional <laughs> attachment like we do. So, I think it's just about your own, like, your own mind. Like, can you really block out emotions? Oh, I like you. Oh, he's really cute. Oh, I can see actually together because you can't right. it's just right. a friend and that's it not a boyfriend girlfriend a friend with benefits meaning you're they're your friend y'all can still hang out in a group mm -hmm. of people but y'all having sex outside the group yeah and, that's the, whole it. Group, that's and the whole group nine out of ten the whole group knows that y'all the whole group knows what y'all are doing right and uh and, time, and, yeah. and some of your friends are like messy instigating y'all out yeah. and then say a dude came up to me and my my friend with benefit buddy is right here Somebody in this group to be like, oh, you see, you see that nigga over there trying to talk to Terry? <laughs> to him, trying to piss him off. I play devil's advocate like, you know, oh, I think y'all might actually work. Y'all are so cute together. And they start putting those thoughts in your head. You're like, man. Feeding you. Like, are they? Seeds. Like, I mean, can we be together? No, you cannot be together. <laughs> no. It doesn't work like I'm, I'm going to just, no. me personally, friends with benefits doesn't work for me. If I start to like you, then I'm going to like you. And I'm, I'm not going to talk to anybody else. I'm only gonna talk to you. See, you and I was talking about. You no, I'm not, no, no, no. I'm not overly emotional though. I know <laughs> when. No, no, no. Hell no. Fuck like that. Yes. If you can't no. be friends with this, have you I mean, we did what we did, and then it got boring to me, so then I just stopped. So that's fine. But if we do what we do, and it's good, and exciting, and fun, and fresh, and it stays like that for a while, it don't stay like that though. She live in a fantasy world. <laughs> I swear, she live in a fantasy world. Like she I don't live in a fantasy Cinderella, world. But I Lose do. I believe in fairy tales. That could happen. 
happened? This is wrong. You see what Disney did to us? <laughs> no. Oh, I forgot. I'm, I can't be bitter. So let me not be bitter. So, no, like ladies and fe and dudes. You know what I'm saying? Because sometimes dudes catch feelings too, and it's not that type of situation. Just know what kind of situation you're in. And if right now you watching this and you think you're in a friends or benefit situation, <laughs> you might want to go ask your nigga. <laughs> Somebody, okay, don't, no, no, don't ask what are we because they just gonna shut down. Just right. be like, you know, or test them or something like this. Say, hey, I'm gonna go out with such as that's cool. That's right. not cool. Too fast, and no, it's not cool. Right. Like on Love Chase. Like on Love Chase. So, benefit situations. No. Nah, they don't work for me. I no. can't do it. Don't ever try to put me in that situation. Well, now, when I was younger, I would play those games and do all that stuff. Now I'm a little older, a little bit more mature, and I just don't. I don't want to play games. So, no to friends with benefits. So, y'all let us know how y'all feel about that. Like, if you are in a friends with benefits relationship, let us know. Like, we want to hear your story. So, see how it's working out for you. Cause right. If, and if you've been in a successful <laughs> friends with benefits. Yeah, I want to hear that story. Right. Definitely. I want to hear about those people, those of you who've been in friends with benefits situations. And y'all together good. Now. You know, or if y'all, a relationship came out of that. Mm -hmm. Let me know how that works. Because, you know what I'm saying? Maybe it's just me. <laughs> maybe it's us. Maybe it's just us. Too much. Do it. I I like the sex is. If the sex is good, you don't want to say. I'm gonna want to keep doing <laughs> it, and I'm gonna want nobody else to be doing it. <laughs> so <laughs> y'all hit us up. Let us know. www.gossiprunway.tv every day, all day. Let us know what you think. Leave your comments. We'll be right back with part two.